Hey, what's up, Internet? Today I wanted to do a little update on the 128 gigabyte images that are many most people are talking about in the community, and uh, that's Ray's, Ratty Dave's, and then recently uh, Mad Little Pixel tried working on an image, and uh, it was really cool that he uh, compressed it to make it a little smaller. I let him know that you know it doesn't work with the Patriot, doesn't work with Sandisk, and the Samsung that I bought, the Evo Plus, also did not have enough space. My Patriot actually had more space, and um, so he made it smaller, and I just went the last couple days downloading it again, uh, reached my data cap on my uh, Comcast, so be aware of that. You do get two or three months for free as far as the grace period, but do be careful that you uh, don't get overcharged this month for downloading large files. Um, but as I was mentioning, it's just too big of a file. You know, I went to go write it and it's still about 50,000 or 50 million bytes too big. So I even have the image open here. So when you go to write, it says, sorry, there's not enough sectors. And I tried, you know, formatting my micro SD as much as possible. And if you just want the quick answer to this, I really think you just got to go buy a 200 gig SD or you have to um, buy, do either Ratty Dave's or uh, Ray's image <clears throat> because those will fit on most 128 gigabyte SD card. So here's the new image here. It's a 128 billion, 94 million bytes. So if you're getting an SD card, it has to have at least that many bytes on it for it to fit. So before you download it, I would actually buy the SD card and just make sure that the one you have fits. The best thing to do though, is just buy a 200 gig SD. And uh, we're going to talk about SD cards in just a second. But before we get there, just so you know what kind of spaces you're looking at, the original Ray's image uh, is only 127. Uh, billion eight hundred sixty-five million. So it's significantly different, especially when most micro SDs are right around the hundred twenty-eight billion, not much more. Like uh, you can see here, my um, my Patriot that's plugged in right now. I did I did a slow format, not even a quick format, and I tried to expand as much as I could. And uh, as you see, I'm about fifty-three million or fifty-two point five million bytes off from. Uh, what I need. I need a 50 million added to this SD for it to work. And uh, so it's just not going to work. So um, 128.41. But as we see here with uh, Ray's, you know, I've got an extra, you know, couple hundred million. Updated Ray's is 127.865. So not much more than the regular. And then uh, the <clears throat> Ratty Dave's is actually really good the version two, because it's even less. So like even if you get like a generic 128 gigabyte SD card, like not even a high quality one, uh, it'll fit. Instead of 119, it's 96 gigs and it's only 103 billion bytes. So um, when it comes to 128 megab gigabyte uh, images, I mean, they all kind of have their pros and cons. I mean, I, there's plenty of videos out there to watch, um, but to me, it's a price thing, especially with the Raspberry Pi community because you're, you're buying a Raspberry Pi for like 30 or 40 bucks or whatever, and then you're gonna spend all this money on an SD card. I mean, especially in a lot of these games, you might not even be playing. So if you want like a set it and forget it type of thing, I really think you gotta buy a 200 gig SD card and then all the images are gonna work. Um, or just go get the 128, because that's, that's a, it's a big difference. Like going from a 128 to a 200, you're going from $40 to 70. So you can almost have two of these for the price of one of these. If money's not an object to you, just get the 200 gig and be done. And I'll put a link in the description to the 200 gigs I recommend. I recommend the Lexar, and I recommend the SanDisk, and I recommend the, the Samsung Evo Plus. Make sure you get the Evo Plus. Uh, those are all really good cards. I don't recommend like this generic one here. PNY is very garbage. Patriot is fine. Some people say they're a little slower. I haven't had any issues with them but Patriot might work as well. But for the price, the Patriot is the same price as the SanDisk usually. So, you know, $40 there for the 128 and $40 here for the 128. And just like the 200 gig is about 70, it's 69. And then the 200 gig here is uh, 69 as well. So similar pricing. And if you're gonna get the, if you have, it's the same price, get the SanDisk over the Patriot. So uh, Lexar, Patriot, SanDisk, Samsung, Evo Plus, not the Select, uh, are all good. There's a Samsung Pro, but like the Pro 128 is the same price as a 200 gig of these other Ultra and the and the Patriot. So I would just either go for the 200 or go for the 128. 
if you're interested in the images, um, here is uh, Mad Little Pixel's latest video. I'll put a link in the description. This is the one I downloaded. It's too big. You need a 200. I know he says it's 128, but I wish he would have told. I wish he would have put how many bytes it was in the description here because uh, it's still too big for most 128. So this is kind of this is more of a 200 gigabyte image in my in my mind. And uh, otherwise, I have my Ray's Ultimate Image Attract Mode Complete Install Guide, um, which gets MSX2 working, Virtual Boy, all the stuff that comes stock. Uh, we get it working in that video. And then uh, Ratty Dave's. And Ratty Dave's has a few more less games, um, but it has bezels. So if you really like bezels, it comes pre-installed. Uh, you can always add bezels to Ray's image. Um, so you could do that there. And uh, so you have those three as kind of the primary ones that I see around a lot. I see some others, but these ones are pretty wide. And uh, the download is not super, super slow. So there you go. I'm going to go ahead and put links to not only the images, but links to the um, to the Amazon links as well. Amazon has a really good return policy as well. So that's why it's good to order through them, because even if you like get the wrong one or you change your mind, usually you can return it and uh, get all your money back. Um, and then you don't have to drive and things like that. If you can use the referral links that I post below that really help me out. Um, those are called Amazon affiliate links. And basically because I send you there. Um, I get like a little bit of commission because I sent you there. The, the price to you stays the same, but it helps this channel out. And uh, just so you know, when I get things like that, I've already, I recently just bought a um, capture card. So um, you can even see the Aver Media that uh, it should be coming any day now. I ordered this one here. So the money that you guys do by either donating or by, um, you know, using the referral links, do get invested back into this channel. So if you could do that, it's just going to make the quality of the videos better and get you more information that helps you out. Because, you know, the whole reason why I made this video is because this was the second time I've downloaded this image now and uh, the second time that it wouldn't fit on the SD card I had, which is a little frustrating. And as I mentioned, you know, Comcast now doesn't have unlimited data. So it's kind of a pain. As far as like people ask me, what's the best image? You know, it's up to you. Like I said, if you like, if you have a SD card that's very small and you already own it, get Rowdy Dave's because it's smaller. If, uh, you know, you've seen my videos on Rays and has everything you want on it, just get Rays. Um, as far as if you get an image and you like don't like it or something, that's perfectly fine. What I recommend is just extracting the games that you own and that you want and then uh, making your own image with that because now you have all the artwork and the images from the um and the roms from the from the 128 gig and you could just build your own from there uh the other thing to consider is building your own and just downloading the roms one by one but yeah i know that could be a little longer of a process i hope this video helps you out if you could please like and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time